Hello and welcome back to the channel everybody. Today I'm going to show you how to set up your Thrustmaster Airbus throttles uh, with the new Anybuilds A340. Here it is in all its glory right now but let's jump inside. The first thing you need to do everybody is make sure that your throttles are set up correctly inside the simulator. So we need to go into the settings so go into controls here into uh, select your quadrant throttle right there and then just put throttle in the search bar and it's going to uh, pick up all the designations there so as we've got right here throttle one axis that's the one you're looking for so that's for engine one by the way we're going to have four engines uh, don't make the mistake of uh, going for throttle one axis um, 1 to 100 which we see there right there you want to make sure you got the one that just says throttle 1 axis throttle 2 axis throttle 3 axis etc now you look at the name here see how we've got an x on the end that's your left hand throttle is x so we'll bind engines 1 and 2 to x which is your left hand throttle and your right hand throttle right there is y at the end so joystick l axis x for your left hand throttles and uh, joystick L axis Y for your right throttle. So we'll bind all four engines, except we've only got two throttles, so two engine per throttle. So what we want to do now is go back into the sim, and this bit here, well, it's pretty easy, so we'll just resume. Uh, we'll go into our electronic flight bag, and at the same time, oh, uh, there, I think, there we go. Uh, and I've just brought up my throttle quadrant now up in the uh, top right-hand corner, I believe. And so you can see what I'm actually doing with it. But anyway, go into the throttle calibration right there. And this is really simple. I've already set it all up. Um, but press reset calibration right here if you need to. Now down at the bottom here, you've got uh, whether you want the reverses on the axis, which I definitely do. That means I can set the reverse thrust on my throttle right there. Uh, down below here, depending on how many throttles you've got. In this one, obviously, I've got two. So I select two axis. But um, you, know, you might have four. You might have all four. Uh, or you might just have one of those single joysticks. But anyway, over here. Here goes the little marks. We're going to start there with set max reverse position. And uh, what I'm going to do is pull my uh, throttles right back into the max reverse. And then I just simply click on set max reverse position. And there you go. It's set right there. So now I push it back up to the next indent there. The set idle reverse. Once again, click on it. Uh, and away we go. Oh, we'll get it right. There we go. And then it's idle. Yes, we'll get it right. There we go. You can follow along, everybody. And the rest of it's pretty self-explanatory here. You just go to the next uh, setting, set the button, and then finally you do toga, and away you go. It really is as simple as that, ladies and gentlemen. It's very, very simple to operate. Um, so if you have any questions, let us know down in the comments. But thanks for watching. Take it easy.